My name is Chai Woodruff. I'm a product manager with Rely On Battery. In this week's Tech Tuesday, we're going to cover mounting and installing your new lithium batteries. After determining which Rely On model will best suit your power needs, the most important consideration is how you will mount your batteries. Check where your batteries are currently stored. Is it inside or outside the vehicle? Will your new batteries fit in the current space? Lithium batteries may be mounted upright or on their side because they contain no liquids like a flooded lead acid battery. Regardless of where you place them, we recommend securing your batteries to prevent damage while your vehicle is in motion. Before we get started, please be sure to wear protective gear when handling batteries. PPE includes gloves, eye protection, and tools with insulated or rubber coated handles. Also be sure to use an appropriate cable size based on the expected load of your system. A table with the gauge sizes we recommend is included in the comments below this video. Today's example will be the simple replacement of the single 64 amp hour lead acid group 24 battery that came standard with this trailer. We'll install a 100 amp hour rely on RB100 group 31. The process from start to finish is relatively easy and should only take about 15 minutes. One of the first things to consider are the physical dimensions of the battery you're replacing. The stock Group 24 battery is much smaller than the Group 31 RB100 replacement. Check the dimensions of your new battery. A replacement battery box can be found at your local trailer supply or on Amazon by searching for the keyword battery box. Begin by disconnecting first the negative and then the positive terminal of the old battery. Unless further secured by a strap or bracket, remove the old battery by lifting it out of the case by its handle. At the bottom, you will see four bolts. Remove these with the appropriate size socket. Set the bolts aside. We'll need them to mount you the new battery box to the trailer. After you've removed and set the bolts aside, the old Group 24 battery box can also be removed. The easiest way to mount the new Group 31 battery box is to place it on the frame where you want it mounted and mark the underside with a Sharpie. You can then use a drill to make holes at the points you marked with the Sharpie. If your bolts are the self-tapping kind, you can use them to punch the holes in your new case like the example shows. Next, insert your bolts in the new holes on the inside of the case and place it in the mounting frame on the trailer. Tighten the bolts until they are snug on the frame and your new battery box is mounted. Insert your Rely On battery in your newly mounted battery box. Connect the positive terminal and then the negative. Be sure to securely tighten the positive and negative terminals to the proper torque values. Torque values are different for each battery and can be found on your model's data sheet on our website. We also suggest filling any gaps between the battery and box wall to prevent your battery from shifting while the trailer is in motion. Although more secure methods exist, we also recommend securing your battery box with a chain or nylon strap with steel core to prevent theft. If you need help determining a suitable replacement for your RV, please don't hesitate to contact us for more information.